Hello friends, this is Tushar Vikute. Today uh, we are going to see some different kind of system or al algorithm in Python by which uh, a very common operation like swapping the content of variables or exchanging the content of variables will be done by different ways and we'll find the most effective way to do these operations here. Let's open the Python terminal first. Let's see what do you mean by swapping and how this swapping operations can be performed here. So I'm opening the Python's terminal. Let's take one variable x which is whose value is 10, y whose value is 15 and now I want to put the content of x into y and y into x. The very common method that we use here is uh, by performing by using another variable temporary variable here let's take t is equal to x x is equal to y and y is equal to t so x and y are now exchanged this is a very commonly used method that everyone applies uh, simplicity is the feature of this particular method the problem here is that but we require extra variable when temporary variable we use we are wasting the space to save this data into another variable so instead of using this uh, can make use of some arithmetic operations also with the help of these arithmetic operations we can uh, uh, swap the contents of these variables so let's see again uh, let's make use of x and y so x is 10 and uh, y is 15 so x is equal to x plus y y is equal to x minus y and x is equal to x minus y so let's see x and y the contents are swapped this is also one of the commonly used method uh, the advantage of using this method is that we are skipping the third variable in this particular process so your yes, space complexity is saved but uh, we are using two subtraction operations and one addition operation to perform this again uh, one more method is there to overcome this so most effectively with the uh, high amount of speed we can perform these similar operations okay let's do that one also so let's define x again is 10 y is equal to 15 and now let's do this one have you heard about uh, XOR operator? So if not, let's look at this symbol. This is present over the numerical keypad or numerical key 6. This is called as XOR operator. Uh, XOR operator that C, C++, Java is having similar way. Python is also having the XOR operator. What's the meaning of this? Do you know the XOR operation? XOR operation is the bitwise operation. Bitwise operation means, let's check this out. So I will explain this first, what do you mean by bitwise operation and how can we do this. So let's take this, for example, I am having 1010, first uh, number and second number is 1111. Now for this case, if I want to perform the XOR operation, so this is bitwise operation, so bit by bit operation is performed. When the bits are same, its output is 0 and the bits are not same it will be 1 now it means that when doing XOR operation of these two so your result will be so 1 1 is 0 then 0 1 is 1 again 1 and 1 is 0 and 0 1 is 1 so this is the result of XOR operation of these two numbers so with the help of this also uh, we can perform the operation make sure that this is a logical operation bitwise operation so it needs or it takes least amount of time than uh, subtraction and uh, addition so if you're performing this operation three number of times your numbers values inside the variables will be swapped let's try that one and then we we'll see practically how it actually performs the operations here so I'll go here let's use this XOR operator here first XOR X is equal to X XOR Y second XOR again make sure that uh, for all bitwise operation first or second operation operation positions if you are changing then also a result will not change Y is equal to X XOR Y and again X is equal to X XOR Y so let's see this X Y the contents are swapped 
this is one of the most effective method that uh, we can use to swap the content of two different variables uh, applicable to all other programming languages also uh, now uh, why it is effective method because it is doing operation bit by bit no any algorithm is involved in that because internally your computer system is having the logical gate inbuilt so the operation performed by logical gates are considered as the most effective operation to do okay now let's see it's done it's a magic but not a magic actually there's a logic present behind it let's see what logic is present there so i'll go to this now this was the first operation let's define this what we have this is the x okay and this is y okay this is y and now let's see this is x okay x is equal to x x or y then y is equal to again x and y so this and this number we are x sorry so let's check this one so first of all 1 0 is 1 then 1 1 is 0 then 1 0 is 1 then 1 1 is 0 okay and finally x again with these two numbers we are x sorry so 1 0 1 is sorry 0 1 is 1 1 0 is 1 0 1 is 1 1 0 is 1 let's look at this two and the first two so x was one zero one zero it is 10 uh, binary number and uh, y was one 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 15 number which is now x and x was this it has become y now so this is how the operation of swapping will be done I, I'll make sure that this operation is applicable only to the integer numbers so these integer numbers can be used to perform these operations swapping one of the most effective operation to do so any one of this method can be chosen but uh, i'll prefer the last method the effective method not time consuming actually if you have any doubts regarding this video you can comment to this video on youtube or you can mail us at contact at the rate mitu.co.in thank you thanks a lot